All right, so I'm gonna show you how to fill out a program instruction sheet and then transfer the stimuli that you choose for your program sheet onto the corresponding data sheet. Um, and then at the end of this, you'll see the program ran um, as is so that you can see kind of start to finish how you would create something like this, write it out on your sheets, and then um, perform the program with a participant. So for this one, um, it's Peak Direct Match Colors 7B. And for this one, you're just picking pairs of cards that have various colors on them. So for number one, I might pick red. So I'm gonna need two cards that are both the same, identical red shade, size, etc. The next one I'm gonna pick is blue. The third one will be pink. The fourth will be, let's say, yellow. And the last one will be green. So you might pick different stimuli based on your participant's age, how many stimuli they can handle intermixed, um, things like that. But this is just a generic sample of what one of these might look like. Um, so the program instruction sheet is now filled out. So for level one, which is where we're starting completely new with this program, we haven't run anything off of it yet. Date introduced would be today's date, which is the 14th. And then that's really all I'm gonna fill out on my program instruction sheet at this time because it's brand new and we're just starting it. Then over here for the direct training data sheet, the participant's name, I'm just gonna write demo up at the top, the program name, 7B match colors, and then I'm gonna start filling out my block. With direct, you're only direct training. You're not doing any tests. You're not intermixing anything within this block. You're only using these five stimuli within this block um, to run the program. So for the first one, I might put a five. So I would be doing green first. Then I might do a three for pink next. Then maybe a two for my third trial would be the blue color. My next one, I might do a one to get red put in there. My next one, I might do a four for yellow, then a two for blue, then let's do another yellow, green for the five, three for pink, and one for red. I would put today's date, my initials, and now I would go to run the program. Each trial is gonna be um, saying put with same color, um, and then I would be taking my data for each trial. When all 10 trials are complete, then I would total my response score after that, um, and then this program would be complete. So what you're gonna see next is this program run straight through with these stimuli that we've picked and filled out the sheet, and at the end, you'll see what the data sheet looks like with all of the scores on there and the total response score when it's complete. So I hope this helps just kind of show how you move from the program instruction sheet to the data sheet um, for a direct program. Hey, put with same. Oh, try that again. That's green. And what color is this? Yellow. Put with same. Good. That's putting with same. Here. Put with same. Good. Blue and blue is the same. Put with same. That is putting with same. Good. Let's do another one. Put with same. Awesome. Red and red is the same. Put with same. What color is this? Yellow. Put with same. Good. Putting with same. See that. All right. Put with same. Good. Putting with same. Put with same. Good. Let's do another one. Put with same. Awesome, you're so good at your colors. Put with same. Hmm, I can't tell which one it is. Put with same. Good, pink does go with pink. Now I can tell. Put with same. Awesome, you put it with same. All right, go ahead and check your scoring for Peak Direct. Matching colors, 7B.